So we're going to check to see if the gantry square, reading the articles that Thunder has, there's two methods. Uh, we're going to start with the y-axis first, so my power's off, so I can move my gantry back and forth. We're going to come over here, and I'm going to use this entire uh, ruler here. So I am going to pick a spot there, and then adjust that so that that's tight. And now I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to see if we have the same measurement from here to there. And you can see that my gantry is out of square uh, from the rollover or whatever was in the, you know, with the damage. So now I'm going to have to fix it. Uh, and we'll, we'll move on to, to fixing it here in a moment. So we're going to take this coupler right here and all I'm going to do is loosen it. If I can get the hex head. So we're going to loosen it. And I just broke it free enough. Yep, I'm free enough. Now, what I'm going to do is try and remember where I did with my known distance blocks. So I have two blocks that are the same length. I'm going to drag this forward. And I'm going to pin that right there. And I'm going to hold. And then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna put that one in the same spot and catch it. I'm gonna hold straight and then I'm just gonna tighten these back up. <clears throat> Now I'm going to power the machine up and let it home and we're going to measure it again. So we move the gantry. And then we'll move the gantry back. Turn the power off since I'm right there and I don't want to. So now the power's off. And I'm going to come and I'm going to set my. Okay. I'm going to move to the other side. And I'm going to see if we're. How far we're off. And if you get a close look there, the tolerance is a half a millimeter and I am about a half a millimeter off. So I'm in tolerance according to Thunder.